Hello there, YouTube people. My name is Shane, aka Simpson289, with guest star again, Riley Richard, aka Riley Richards. And we're here to do a commentary, do a commentary of top 10 interesting things about Shane. No. Now, Shane, you're gonna have a lot more interesting stuff to talk about this video since that was yeah. minimally involved. In yeah, this. you you just supplied the camera equipment. Oh, there's Ryan. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now that I notice, uh, today's the fifth of February. Just about a year ago, I made this video. About yeah. So it it is old by our standards, but it's still fun to talk about. It gives us more to talk about. Yeah. Plus, it is almost ten minutes long, so we get, we can put a lot of content into this commentary. Yeah. Pretty sick song. Yeah, it is. Anyway, I can play guitar, which I'm actually taking guitar classes here, so... Yeah, at our high school? Yeah, I'll be able to learn more, and hopefully do some more sicker guitar stuff in later videos, uh, but... there's your room? The yep. house? Sorry. Uh, that's my living room. Yep. In case... If some of you, um, noticed that song, it's actually, um, Sonic the Hedgehog's theme song from Sonic Adventure 2 that mm -hmm. I'm playing on there. A little inside trivia. Yeah, I know. Oh, and Ryan has a heart attack from my awesomeness. That's the thing about Shane, he's the master of randomness. Yeah. My videos tend to be over the top, but they end up pretty damn funny. I think Ragtag Bootleggers was just all impro. Yeah, improvised. it was I, all impro. I tried to script it, but it just didn't work. Yeah. Oh man, oh, this is my favorite part. This is the chocolate milk epicness. I tried to make this as over the top and epic as I possibly could. And, and you did a very good job. Of it, it turned out amazing. I love this. is my favorite part of the entire video. It's like every you know cheesy kind of movie with like this. action cut movie. You know? Yeah, it's like every cheesy action movie ever made. Yeah. That's but I made it awesome. So it, it and um while I'm you know mixing the milk, if you can hear my voice in the background while I'm mixing it, my action going. <laughs> And then Ryan drinks it, and he's disgusted. I don't know why I make pretty damn good chocolate milk, too. Do you use a lot of chocolate sauce? Uh, no. I use a lot. <laughs> okay. Ah, this is actually based, this is actually a true story. You actually swallowed a marble. In grade two, I did. I actually swallowed a marble. I had to go to the hospital to get it removed. Wow. Yeah. So this is a little reenactment of my stupidness. <laughs> Was it, is it pretty close to the real thing? Yeah, I actually thought it was a gumball too. That just that just shows how stupid eight year olds can be. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you know what's? Did that that's actually a true story too. When I was five, I sh uh, took a pencil. Oh, like those little things you stuck yeah, in pencil. I ripped it off and I actually did shove it up my nose. Why? I don't know. I was an idiot back then. Okay, calm down. <laughs> Obviously, you just found that off of Google. Yeah. And then that's me with the eraser in my brain. Now, if you uh, have yeah. How did you How did you get it out? I don't remember. I think I just went like, <laughs> and that's how that worked. So no hospital involved. I don't think so. Even then, I think it went into my brain actually, so I can't remember. I don't think it. I don't yeah, think a little there. It explains how I got my beard too. It was stuck in the period really low of my brain. That's how I have a beard. <laughs> anyway, I have. This was. Uh, Let's give a little background of this before we get into the video a little further. I made this for grade 9 English class, which was just about a year ago. Yeah, about, yeah. Yeah, um, we had to do this little project, 10 things about ourselves that we find interesting that other people might want to know. And we had to give an oral presentation. Since I'm not really good with oral presentations, I decided, hey, why? I like to make videos, so why not? Let's just make a video about this. Yeah. And this, most of this stuff is not true. It is completely fiction. About me, but... But, then again, you wouldn't tell your English I wouldn't tell my teacher that. Actually, um, the presentation was only supposed to be five minutes, and um, this ended up being almost ten. Usually, if it went over the uh, limit, you'd get marks reduced, but my teacher loved it so much that she gave me bonus marks. That is awesome. That is awesome. I loved English last year. Anyway. And this yeah, I, I act like this is some random dog I don't know, but this is actually my two-year-old golden lab. Morgan. That's Morgan. Dakota's a black one, right? Yeah. Yeah, she's a good dog. Yeah. And it's like she scares the shit out of me here when she's following me. Does she always do that? Yeah, she does. And it's like there. Yeah, the reason we filmed these two scenes, like, up, you know, on the side. Yeah, you have the camera on the side. Yeah. 
Uh, you know, since the camera's widescreen, we couldn't capture all of what we wanted, so we had to put it on the side. Oh, this is one of my favorite parts. It's not the whole Martha thing with Ryan stroking my head, it's what I do right here. You're not my wife! You jump on the bed for no reason. I know, that was totally improv. 4.5. Yeah, 4.5. Uh, Kung Fu Panda reference here. This is, has Kung Fu Panda written all over it. I can't believe you like PS3 better than Xbox. Oh, yeah, Whoa. and, um... This is based off an argument we had. Yeah, this is actually... We were playing Xbox before we started filming, so I thought, hey, just why not just have a little rant? Like, a little rant this, on which system is better. Yeah, this is, like, almost word for word what we said back and forth between each other. Yeah. It doesn't really matter. Both of them are awesome systems, so... Yeah. That was uncalled for and cruel to the PS3 fan base. I got a good laugh at that first time I saw that. Who's <laughs> even old? Yeah, this play word by word was taken from Kung Fu Panda. Really? Yeah. Nah, I figured it out. Skadoosh. And then, where'd you find that? I I forget actually. I, f I randomly typed in Google uh, explosions on Google and I found that. <laughs> I want to use that for some of my later videos, but I couldn't. I can't remember where I found it. Yeah, I think anyone would be scared of a 20 to 30 foot fall. And you show the top yeah, of the house. No, yeah. Thank you. I was like looking up at the roof, thinking that I was gonna go up there and jump off. And it's like, a cop out. It yeah, no thank you. Well. And then Ryan gives me the Kung Fu Nerve Punch. Which makes you laugh your ass off. I know. I'm just rolling on the ground laughing maniacally because I am a strong individual. Notice the snow on the ground in the corner. Yeah. It was pretty cold out. It was. No, and then the next day, like, overnight it had blizzard, so we didn't do anything outside because it was, like, freezing cold and it was covered in snow. Yeah. Anyone who knows me knows I hate reading, so this is pretty much a true story. You're reading the easiest book to read upside down. Hey, books are my weakness. I'm not. I'm, in, I'm not a fan of reading either. Yeah. I don't get it. Supposed to be like but you want to read the character in the Rock for some reason, dude. I want to see why it would make someone want to kill John Lennon. That's why I want to read it. South Park made fun of that. Uh, yeah, I'd probably get my ass kicked if I was using a pen as a weapon. So, no, and I love how like. It cuts back between me and Ryan, and every scene, it cuts back to me. Morgan's a little bit closer to me. Yeah. <laughs> it was like, originally, I, I, it was like, originally, I wanted to, like, be carrying her in the third scene, but, you know, she's way too big to carry now, so. So she just disappears. She just disappears. Continuity here. Oh, shut up. I don't believe me. Oh, I love this scene. It's like, close-up of my epic face, and then I throw it like a ninja star, and then Morgan goes to see if Ryan's Wait. okay. <laughs> With the obvious cut. Yeah. Which you see in a lot of cheesy yeah. movies. That was actually pretty smooth, though. This scene, I have no idea why I did this scene. This was shot in my old crappy room before I got redone. My room looks amazing now. Anyway, so pretty much here, I'm trying to make, I'm trying to get across that I'm good at imitating people. Intimidating. So I'm making fun of Ryan for no reason, even though he's my best friend that I've known for like 10 years. I'm pretty sure you're not a dude. I love how I'm doing the commentary, even though I was absolutely not involved in this yeah. video. You were you were in it, you didn't do anything with it. It's just like, I I'm, I'm referencing the conversation earlier. Yeah. Oh, here's the real number one. Ah. Yeah, the real number one. Obviously that's bullshit. Obviously that is bullshit, but you know. We want to, we want to make this as over the top as possible, so why not? Obvious cut. Ryan has a different pose. Sweet. Is that a money? Is that a 10 there? Is that a t no, that was two fives. Well, that was yeah. interesting, wasn't it, right? Or it was a 10 to 5, yeah, I forget. Yeah. Americans are probably watching this one and what the fuck is with that Monopoly awesome money? money? Yeah. Stupid American. Assholes. Actually, I do know one American. Uh, if you're you'll probably watch this right now, actually. Uh, if you turn them to Nick Cossie, kick your ass. Yeah. That kid is... is I know. Oh, I oh, and um, you know Alan Roca? You know Alan? It's like, this scene was making fun of him because he's a PS3 fanboy. I thought the scene was more making fun of me. No, I said Alan, so I'm like, Xbox for the win. You suck, PS3 boys. Did he get a good laugh out of that? No, it, while we, when I showed it in class, he was like right across from me, so he just sat, he just looked at me with like a smile on his face. I could tell what that would have been like. Yeah. Anyway, that's the end of the video, so goodbye, YouTube peoples.